Uh, order, order. We're going to get our meeting started. Uh, first off, as Dean of Students of Cornell University, I'd like to personally congratulate Professor Peter and his recent uh, archaeology artifact discovery. <laughs> oh no! He's still breathing, but there's no heartbeat. There's a ransom note. It says, where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. This looks like a job for Pennsylvania Pete. Hola, senor. Hola, senorita Pete. I'm senor Pete. What had what had bring you here to El Salvador today? Well, I'm glad you asked, friend, because I'm on a mission. A mission to find a treasure. A treasure that'll lead me to the heart. Oh, okay. Here's a map I have oh, for you. Oh, okay. Oh, it's right over here. Right. You lead the way, amigo. Okay, amigo. No, Keith, I know what I'm doing. I, Fabrizio von Seidet Sticker, have conducted the greatest plan in Czechoslovakian history. Pete has crawled right into our trap, and he will lead us to the treasure. <laughs> <laughs> no, Keith, that is my job. I do the laugh. I cannot believe that we made it to the El Cabo de Lamo. We made it! We made it! We went to the cave, Dad! Come, come, Keith! Oh. Wait, Senor. Any step you make can trigger the booby traps. Yes, yes. He's a trap. Sit, sit, steady! Shh. Any loud noise can make the whole place collapse. Alright, alright. Let's keep going. I think we're near the treasure. I got dead by a snake once. Oh my goodness! It's the treasure! But where's the heart? Well, that's alright. Uh, I'll just put the treasure in my satchel. Come on. Let's get out of here, guys. Looking for this pretty boy? Ah. Oh no. The walls are gonna collapse! Let's get out of here! Let's go, Keith! Let's get out of here! Go, Keith! Dr. Carson, you're welcome. Thank you, Pennsylvania Pete, for retrieving my heart. You know, when I think of treasure, I think of something that is better than what most people think of treasure. Most people think of treasure as money or greed or wealth or just anything um, physical. And I think of treasure as God's love for us and the love that he has shown to us through his son and through the word of God. Now I'd like to read this passage, Matthew 6, 19-21. Do not lay up for yourselves treasures on earth, where moth and rust destroy, and where thieves break in and steal. But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven, where neither moth nor rust destroys, and where thieves do not break in and steal. For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Amen.